Okay, so this is question three from the general gas law uh, questions. I've started off here with what I know and what I don't know. So V1 we've got 320 cubic centimetres, P1 4.2 times 10 to the 5 pascals, T1 390 Kelvin. That's good, it's in Kelvin, don't need to change the temperatures. And then after the event, we've got V2 is 380 cubic centimetres. Again, checking the units are consistent, can leave that there. The second pressure is the unknown, so P2 is a question mark. And then T2 is 470 Kelvin. Again, it's in Kelvin, don't need to change the units. So we've got all six items here. So we're going to use the general gas equation P1V1 over T1 equals P2V2 over T2. And that's your first stage there, to at least get the equation written down. You now match up everything that's in what you've got written down there in your shopping list as it is on the equation. So we've got 4.2 times 10 to the power of 5. You can't rush this. There's a lot of information to put down. It's the most complicated equation you're going to do in National 5. Over 390 equals P2 is what we're trying to find. So we'll leave that as a letter. Times 380 divided by 470. What we will now want is we now want P2 on its own on the top of the equation. So the 380 and 470 need to disappear from that side of the equation. I'm going to simplify things. I'm going to do that on my calculator. The 4.2 times 10 to 5 times 320 divided by 390 gives me 344615 as a number. Now, to get rid of those two things, what I'm going to do is, like you do in maths, is whatever's on the bottom, I'm going to multiply both sides of the equation by that. So 470 times that. So we've got P2 times 380 times 470. So I've just multiplied both sides of the equation by that number. We've got 380 on the top, so in that case we divide both sides by 380. Divided by 380, and we've also still got the 470. So on this side now, the 380s cancel, the 470s cancel. So we've got P2, and that's equal to 470 times the 344615 we had, divided by 380. You do that in your calculator, and you'll get 4.3 times 10 to the power of 5. So P2 is 4.3 times 10 to the power of 5 pascals, which was the unit of pressure that we had from the top there, and that 